Good evening. It's 8:37 p.m. Ano ba date na 'yon? April 27 ba? Ah, uh, April 27, Wednesday. Uh, welcome to the upper Zoom prayer gathering. La Filnas. All right. Magandang gabi ba uh, uh, Barangay La Filnas. Simbang Pinoy. Pamilyang Pinoy. So tapos na tayo sa praise report and uh, prayer request. Tadako na tayo sa pagbubulay-bulay na pangungunahan ni Brother Aldrin. Ayan, ganda naman ng ano, lukot na papila. Go ahead, Brother Aldrin. Take it away. Joke Rino. Kailangan ni Tito. Ayan. Okay po. Uh, so yan po, nakalagay. 1 John 5.14 If we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. So, pagka babasahin po natin yung sa Tagalog version, uh, may lakas loob tayong lumapit sa Kanya dahil alam nating ibibigay niya ang anumang hingin natin kung ito ay naayon sa Kanyang kalooban. Amen. So, parang ano lang, uh, it, it reminds me lang na uh, when we pray, Uh, God isn't a genie na hindi lang tayo nang hingi. We should ano, we should always think what what his will is. So para malaman natin kung ano yung will natin, will ni God para sa para sa iba. Uh, kailangan magbasa tayo ng Bible so to get to know him more and uh, get confirmation kung kung natalaga yung will ni Lord. So uh, uh, for example kasi uh, ng dumating si Uh, Jasmine and Allison, we've really been searching for for a home church. Nang tinapakiramdaman namin, is this it? Is this it? Kaso ano eh, parang hindi hindi kami feeling at home kasi we were looking for something that ano that uh, a place where we can really serve. Hindi yung para lang umaten. So we can still na ako kasi na-experience ko na yun before gusto ko ma-experience ni Nasmin and Allison kung paano mag-serve and um, yun, nakala ko hindi na mangyayari <laughs> and ano praise the Lord we were able to find La Filnas and uh, praise the Lord talaga He answered our prayers na we were able to find a home church and bless na bless kami sa home church natin and um It's just me and this Jasmine may she share then about uh, God's will. Yeah. When we pray. Mm-mm. Ano po, uh, yung para sa akin naman po, yung pagpunta namin dito ni Alice sa aming nangyari na kailangan kami nag-pray tapos nagsisimba din naman po kami lagi. Hindi nga lang kami nakakapag-serve ng katulad ngayon. Pero parang kinwestiyon ko sigad na bakit ang dami namin na biglang try na po kami sa table kasi nga ang tindi nung plano yung sa ano yung po yung birth certificate ko. Tapos Hanggang sa may nakalala kami, yung pala yung may dahilan po kung bakit natagalan talaga. Po kami ni God na kadali. Hindi ganun ka-easy yung buhay po. Yun po. Sorry po, ano, wala ako. Bumalik na si Pastor. Ayan. Welcome back po, Pastor Joe. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Uh, tanong ko lang ano uh, ilang ilang simbahan bago kayo nakarating sa La Filnas ang more or less uh, bumalik po ako da- bumalik kami sa dati kong church Pag harvest lecture na sabi niya tapos sa tapos temple sa temple sa temple pati word temple sa CP ano yeah, PCF apat yata ah, apat lima tapos sa mabatay sa CCLA ah lima po lima 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 oh lima okay. limang pa paiba-iba every week dito yung damen dito ba talaga dito na dito na dito na <laughs> eh ba- bakit bakit niyo naman ano na 
para paano niya na confirm sa Lord na o oh, dito tayo sa Lafilnas. Dito tayo tinawag. Uh, sa akin po ano, uh, I asked for three signs. Hmm. First sign, um, si Anaya kailangan po magustuhan po niya yung children's ministry. Hmm. And then si Jasmine ma din po madali po siya makapasok sa sarili niyang ministry. Yung, hindi po namin na-expect na pasok sa, sa piging. And then si Allison, magusta po niya yung youth. Mm-hmm. And then, yun na po yung sign ko na, ah, ito na, siguro ito na, uh, babal, uh, I'll try to, ano na, to serve again, to go back to the music ministry. Kasi may mga inatilan po kami na ayaw ni Allison umati ng youth. Oh, ayaw niya. Ayaw niya po talaga. Uh, Kaya si ang namin, ayaw niya. Si Anaya, ayaw din niya dun sa kids. Oh. Tapos pupunta po kami, walang kumakausap talaga sa amin. Oh. Ah, kasi normal na pumasok ka, nakinig ka po, tapos uwi na po, gano'n. Oh, wala kong makausap sa akin. Uh, so, dito, na, na-hit lahat yun. Ah. <laughs> Apo. Parang ano yun, no? eh, parang, eh, naka, naka, ang nakakatuwa doon, hindi lang nila, hindi lang, kumbaga, hindi lang sila nag-enjoy. Mga, mga ano pa sila, sila pa yung mga nangunguna, mga pasimuno ngayon sa mga, sa youth, sa piging, sa, di ba, si ano, oh, walang oh. absent yan sa ano eh, sa, sa children eh, di ba? So nakakatawa. Provinsa na po pag nagkakasakit. <laughs> Oo. So, so yeah, yeah. So it's a, ano, it's a blessing. Oo. Pero maganda yung sinabi mo kanina, may karugtong siya eh. Kasi sabi dito, if we ask anything according to His will, He hear, uh, hears us. Meron kasing according to His will. Eh. Apo. Importante yung, yung phrase na yun. <laughs> yeah, kasi pag wala uh, genie na ang dating ni Lord. Uh, ang galing mo yun. If Apo. He hears anything, He hears us. So, genie na. Pero may according to His will. So, nanghingi ka ng simbahan, according ba sa will mo yan, Lord? Makakatulong ba sa akin to? Diba? Nanghingi ka ng negosyo. Diba? O alimbawa, malaki ang kita, magtatayo ka ng beer house, makakatulong ba sa Lord? Makakatulong ba sa maraming tao? Diba? Makakapagkawang gawa ba ako sa kalapating mababa ang ipad? Diba? Justify mo, siyempre, di ba? Pero according to His will. Is this according to His will? Di ba? O naghahanap ka ng... Uh, papapangasawa o maghahanap ka ng simbahan o maghahanap ka ng negosyo o maghahanap anything no? na na may, may need ka dapat according to his will importante yun eh di ba so, about the others ano masasabi niyo to no, si John ang sumulat nito no uh, kumbaga yung first John kasi meron yan second at saka third no, iba pa si John, uh, gospel of John no? Ah, di ba pa, iba pang sinulat niya yung Revelation? Si John din na sumulat. Nun. Si John the Beloved. Oh. Iba si John the Baptist. How about the others? Anong masasabi niya doon? If we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. Isishare ko ulit yung para makita. Ayan. Actually, napaka-ikli ng verse pero malaman niya. Eh. Ang daming ibig sabihin. Ang dami kang pwedeng take away. Ako po, Pastor. Kahit, tita. Yung pong pagpunta sa Amerika, mm-hmm. yun din po eh, binag-pray ko din yun. Mm-hmm. Tapos nga, ang ano ko, oh Lord, kung walang hindrances, ganyan, makakuha kami ng visa, ganyan, alam ko, will mo na makapunta kami. So, yun, parang tuloy-tuloy lang. Although sa, <clears throat> hindi naman totally smooth. Kasi siyempre nagka, ano rin sa mga pag, uh, pa-sponsorship, ganyan. Mm-hmm. Pero, ultimately, naging okay lahat. Ayos din, pati si LJ. Kasi LJ na, iwan pa, nag-aral pa ng nursing sa Pilipinas. Mm-hmm. Tapos pag natin dito, kinuhanan ko siya ng uh, student visa, ganyan. Hmm. So all in all uh, alam ko na na will ng Lord din na makapunta kami lahat dito. Ayun po. Ay, ngayon eh may apo pa kayong imported. <laughs> 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 Kita mo. 
<laughs> Sabi ko nga, dali natin sa ABS-CBN yan. Kikita tayo dyan eh. Pwedeng artista. <laughs> How about the others? Uh, tingnan ulit natin yung, uh, yung first. Yeah. If we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. Will niya ba na gumanda ang buhay mo? Of course. Diba? Will niya ba na... Kasi minsan, may maling pag-iisip ang krisano na ano eh, na baga uh, hindi, hindi tayo dapat uh, nagkakaroon ng ganito o ganyan. No? Will, will niya na maayos ka? Maganda ang buhay mo? Diba? Sapat, ang, uh, sapat kung ano meron ka. Diba? Huwag ka lang magkamal lang sobra-sobra na wala na wag na ka namang paggagamitan eh iniimpok mo lang at hindi na hindi napapakinabangan hindi sa papakinabangan na nakarami pero will ba ng Dios na mapunta ka sa magandang relasyon syempre will ba ng Dios na maging maganda ang married life mo oo, oo. will ba ng Dios na magkaroon ka ng mga ng mga anak oo naman so mat mat ano ubaga gusto niya kasi ano eh um, maganda ang buhay mo di ba may pagkakataon din naman na hindi ka naman tinawag sa pagkakataon meron ng iba. Pero hindi ibig sabihin na less fortunate ka or less blessed ka. Kasi meron din naman na nakalaan para sa iyo, di ba? So, if we ask anything according to his will, he hears us. Ayan, para yung na-experience sila Aldrin. Di ba? Pinakinggan sila ng Panginoon. So, linggo-linggo nagtatanong sila, Lord, ito na ba? <laughs> Tapos sa kabilang church, Lord, ito na ba? <laughs> So, yeah, kamusta naman yung ano, yung relasyon niyo sa mga taga La Filnas nung, nung nag-decide na kayo. Na ilang ilang linggo bago kayo nag-decide na dito na tayo, parang ganoon. <laughs> Mabilis po eh, mga 2 weeks lang. Kalagkari. Kalagkari pa lang. Tapos nag-serve na ako eh. Ano na? Oh, sa worship ministry na po kagad ako third week eh. Third week. <laughs> Walang 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 musikero. <laughs> Pero ano, uh, actually blessing yun. Blessing. Uh, blessing sa'yo pero blessing din sa church. Totoo lang. Kasi ano, wala nga. YouTube dati kaya, di ba? Naalala nyo yun, YouTube tayo. Kasi ang laki ng void na iniwan ni Sister Hansel. Dahil si Sister Hansel, she can sing and she can play any instruments. no So, ano yun, meron pa siyang drums doon sa kanyang ano, uh, ano yun? Sa kanyang uh, piano. Sa piano yun. No? So, siya rin nakakanta. Sabi ko, naku po, pag umalis to, sino ang papalit dito? So, ang ginawa ng Lord, pinalitan niya full band. Well, half band pa lang ngayon, pero pa-full pa lang. <laughs> Parating na yung pianista at saka bahista. Uh, yung pianista nandun sa uh, ano sa English, nilipat na. Joke lang. <laughs> Baka nagustuhan sumama sa atin ng batang yun eh. Nawili. <laughs> so, yeah, nakakatawa. De, blessing kayo. Blessing kayo sa church. Uh, kakaiba yung, ano, yung, yung pagdagdag nyo, kakaiba rin. No? Yeah. If you ask anything according to His will, He hears us. Anything else? Gusto nyo idagdag? Kasi po, Pastor, ano, talagang pinagpalik ko po yun. Sabi ko kay Lord, Lord, kaya bago po sana mag-rapture, sana makapag-surf po ulit ako <laughs> <laughs> sa inyo. Bago mag-rapture. Para po ma-experience din po ng family ko kung paano po talaga mag-surf sa inyo. Sabi ni Lord, so, ah, ganun na ah. Sabi ni Lord, ah, ganun na ah. O sige, wala ka muna ng reliever ngayon. <laughs> <laughs> kaya, tapos siguro sabi po ni Lord, at tagan mo nag-break ha. O ayan. Uh, <laughs> sulitin, kita, <laughs> sulitin kita ngayon. <laughs> hindi, padating na yung reliever mo hindi pa lang natin kilala kung sino uh, kasi ako ganun ako mag-isip eh honestly when I start something kiniklaim ko lagi no, kumbaga eto lagi kong pinipicture out nung dumating ako sa La Filnas pinipicture out ko may drummer hindi ko kilala dumating si ano si John di ba oh, eh, darating na ganito may mag mayroong mag-relieve sa akin na mag-preach mayroong kumbaga pinipicture out ko na yan and then nagkakatotoo dahil siyempre desire ng puso mo wala hindi naman hindi ba taharangin ni Lord yun di ba eh, uh-huh. history niya yan eh 
Di ba? He's not the man who ano, na capable mag-lie. Di ba? So, ah, po. Pinagpapalik ko din po yan, Pastor. Eh. Yung, yung skilled, hindi lang po skilled, pero they have the heart to yeah, worship. So. Yeah. I don't know if you... Uh, I, I'm sure most of you familiar kay Hannah Abogado. No? Uh, kaya bakit gustong gusto ko yung batang yun? Lagi kong pinapanood, lagi akong nag... Na, basta, patuwi magdadrive ako, halos siya lang ang playlist ko eh. Kasi siya... Worshipper talaga, mararamdaman mo. She worships talaga. So, yun yung ano eh, yun yung uh, difference ng worshipper at saka singer. Kumbaga. So, uh, nakakatawa nga. Pinsan, pag, yung, pag kinakanta natin yung lilim, yung version niya yun eh. Kaboses nga ni Rachel eh. Yung version niya yung ginagamit natin na natutuwa ako na parang nakikinig lang ako na ano. So, yun yun. I-assure natin yung tao sa worship. And you're doing a great job ang worship team, honestly. No? Praise the Lord po. Nakatawa ang uh, worship team natin. Yeah, kahit si Nakiko, si na ano, si na si na Alison, si Jeannie, kahit Tagalog, pinipilit ang kumanta. <laughs> Puro po watermelon. <laughs> Puro po watermelon sinasabi. <laughs> Ayun. Anything else na gusto yung idagdag? Meron akong idagdag, Pastor. When he hears, he prospers the thing. Mm-hmm. Katulad ng God heard the prayers of the Anastasio family mm-hmm. and he has prospered them by using their gifts. The congregation is blessed. Amen. Amen. So kapatid din po ito ng si Key first, eh, di ba? Matthew 6:33. Kumbaga, sa inuuna mo talaga ang Dios, di ba? Kumbaga, at uh, nararapat naman nag mamarapatin ng Dios ay para sa iyo. Di ba? Uh, talagang ibibigay sa iyo, di ba? So, yeah, nakakatuwa lang. So, kasi parang kung titingnan mo yung buhay ni Joseph, parang nadinig mo ba ako, Lord? Di ba? Parang Iyak pa ako ng iyak dito sa kulungan eh. Nadidinig mo ba ako? Parang hopeless na, di ba? Pero he hears eh. Pero according to his will. May proper timing, Joseph. May proper timing na dadaling kita sa sa palas ni Pharaoh at iaanoin kitang governor. Di ba? So siguro, I'm sure, nung pagdating ng time na yon gutom na gutom ka, galing kang prison, payat-payat mo, tapos biglang governor. Umaga, prisoner ka, hapon, governor ka. Di ba? Nag-shift yung bigla yung ano mo. Nakaligo ka na ng maayos. May tagakuskus ka pa sa likod. Kumain ka na ng marami. Ano mo yun? Nakapag-isip ka na ng maayos. Dahil governor ka na eh. Di ba? So, uh, he hears. God hears us. Di ba? And uh, ako, I've seen La Filnas na, na from 15 to 20 attendees. And now, the Lord heard us. Di ba? Minsan, sobra pa. Di ba? Pero pa tayo mga kapatid na pumupunta na naninigaw. <laughs> Yakapin natin yung mga yan, di ba? Uh, matuto tayong ano, uh, maging mapagmahal sa mga taong ganyan. So, yeah, he hears us. He hears us. Yeah. Daming bagay na ano, na pinapakinggan tayo ng Diyos. Amen? Sa buhay nyo, ano ba yung nadinig ng Panginoon na sinagot niya no na according sa will niya di ba di ba according sa will niya kasi ano po, go ahead go ahead go ahead go ahead faith ako para ano pastor Jeffy na isip ko dito yung to pray according to God's will yung hmm. praying the scripture kasi alam mo when you pray the the scripture itself will na ni God yun eh yep so yung parang sure ano na yon sure hit na yon so yeah. it's it I'm reminded to really know what the Bible says about certain aspects of life. Mm. Para ano mo yun, bullseye na. Yeah. Yung ano, sa akin siguro yung pagpunta ko din dito, mm. kasi nga eh, so sudden, tapos mm. biglang ha, parang nag-iba na yung, yeah. nag-iba na yung plano ko. As in, para siyang na-overhaul, ganyan. Yeah. So, Ah, uh, yan ito every day yung pinagpe-pray ko kay God kasi hindi ko na alam eh. Hindi mm. <laughs> ko na. Alam. So parang yung parang there's so many things. Yung yun nga eh, yung yung weekend yung sabi sa scripture din yung weekend plan 
Mm-hmm. We can plan all we want, but he, he is the one who directs our steps. So when we pray according to His will, yung mm-hmm. para I feel like I'm in a better position to recognize also mm-hmm. what He's doing. Ganyan. And uh, ayun, yung confidence, yung confidence ko lang to take, ako personally, yung confidence ko lang to, to take a step of faith mm-hmm. every day is is coming from uh, yun din, yung knowing din yung na, knowing na yung will naman kasi ni God sa for me is really to take care of mama and pep-pep. So parang yun yung pinanghahawakan ko na God. Ito yung na, na perceive ko for this season. So if, the, if, if this is really what you want for my life, uh-huh. then uh, you will direct my steps. You would bring people to help me. Mm-hmm. You would bring resources. Uh, I would be able to meet the very tight schedule kasi sobrang tight. There's so many requirements, paperwork. Iba galing pa sa Pilipinas. Ipapa-DHL ko pa yung iba. Ganyan. So, sobrang tight ng schedule na for me, if it's really God's will, then He will hear it. Ganyan. Exactly. So, yun, so, very personal siya. Bagsat <laughs> ka nang umalis dun sa God's will. Yeah. Huwag ka nang umalis dun sa God's word. Tama. Yun. Pastor. Apo. My scripture that says, man proposes, hmm. but God disposes. Amen. 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 Mm-hmm. May naalala lang po ako na, ano, na isang pastor. Nagpipreach siya. Uh, nakikinig ako sa preaching niya. Ang sabi sa preaching niya, eto God's will to eh itong magandang bahay na to sabi niya ganun. Ah uh, kung saan tayo nagkakaroon ng gathering sabi niya ganun. Tapos kasi bakit God's will to? Imagine niyo ang ganda ng bahay na to. Wala wala akong binabayaran sabi niya ganun. Kasi ano eh uh, alam mo yung ano yung 2008 na bumagsak yung ano yung uh, market, ba? Diba? Yun yung panahon na yun to sabi niya. Uh, ito yung kumbaga uh, dahil sa bahay na to uh, what do you call this uh, ano siya uh, libre libre lahat parang ganon so wala walang binabayaran so medyo nag nag ano nag nag, nag uh, salungat sa utak ko yun ano yung parang Paano naging God's will yun kung hindi ka nagbabayad? <laughs> diba? Parang, ano yun, parang uh, that is something spiritual na kiniklaim. Ha? Kumbaga, kasi, kasi ang nangyari kasi during those times, lahat ng bahay na rimata kasi nga hindi kayang bayaran ng mga tao kasi nga nagbenta na nagbenta patas hindi naman kayang bayaran ng tao. So nangyari, hindi yun, ano, hindi yun isang tao. Ha? Marami yun. Maraming bahay na gano'n. No? Tapos finraise nila. Pero hindi nila ginagalaw So hindi na nagbabayad yung mga tao pero rematado na yon. Pero ang kiniklaim nga nung pastor na, na yung bahay so ginagamit sa sa gawain ng Diyos at uh, blessing dahil hindi nagbabayad. Dahil hindi na nga, hindi na nga tatanggapin yung ay, hindi, kumbaga, hindi na nagbabayad kasi nga maririmata na. So parang nag, ano yung utak ko na ko, paano naging blessing yun? Eh hindi ka nga nagbabayad. Dahil ko parang parang hirap ano na i Kumbaga, yung sinasabi ni Faith kanina eh, na wag ka na umalis doon sa word of God. Di ba? Parang, doon ka lang sa will niya. Doon ka lang sa gusto niya according to his will. Uh, pwede kasi natin i-justify lahat ng bagay. Pero ang bottom line yan eh, according ba talaga yan sa will ng Panginoon? Di ba? Kumbaga, ano niyo yun, yung parang uh, yung ibang ibang ano, ibang ibang religion Diba? Ang justification nila uh, para para marami silang asawa is because yung wealth nila para mahati or para dumami yung lahi or whatever. Ah, madaming klase ng justification. Diba? So pwede mong i-justify pero is that according to His will? Diba? So kumbaga, ngayon uh, very gender sensitive ang panahon ngayon. No? Uh, hindi mo na mapapansin kumbaga bawal ka nang ang dami nang bawal sabihin niyan kasi madami ma-offen, di ba? Parang ganoon. So, kumbaga na na, na, na kinikinig ako nga eh, pagdating ng panahon, baka baka ipagbawal na rin ang gender reveal ng mga bata. <laughs> di ba? Di ba? 
hindi <laughs> ka hindi ka totoo lang kasi di ba kasi ma-offend na naman yung isang grupo na bakit kayo mag-gender reveal eh sigurado niyo ba talagang boy yan o girl <laughs> di naman ganun no? parang siguro darating ang panahon na ganun mangyayari yun di ba pero pwede nating i-justify nga pero alam yon according ba yan sa will ng Panginoon di ba so ayan uh, basta wag kayong halis doon kasi the enemy will try to confuse us uh, pero ang pinakamaganda lagi kang nakastick sa word of god wag kang aalis dapat pag umalis ka malilito ka talaga di ba magigive in ka eh babalutin ka ng emosyon eh di ba babalutin ka ng emosyon so ayun anything else ang sweet dagdag dito <laughs> If we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. Uh, dadagdag ko lang po, Pastor, yung ginagawa po nating prayer meeting. Uh, it's a, I think it's according to His will kasi we are praying for other people. We are encouraging, encouraging each other. We're praying for our leaders in authority, mga pastors, mm-hmm. or our president. So, yeah, nakalagay po sa scripture. So, we are we are doing God's will. So, we claim that He is hearing us and He will answer our prayers. Yung healing, mm. yan po. Actually, po. ano nga yan eh. Uh, uh, for example, yung nangyari ng Sunday, it's not just about physical thing, alam mo yun. Hindi lang naman physical attack yun o verbal abuse yun, alam mo yun. It's a, it's a, it's a, kumbaga, it's a spiritual battle na hindi flesh and blood, kumbaga, no? That's why I encourage the board as well as tayo tong prayer team pero alam ko naman mostly sa inyo busy na paglinggo kaya ano uh, halos lahat kayo o oh, actually kayong lahat <laughs> busy na kayo paglinggo. Kumbaga tantantining na 8:30 to 9 di ba? Mabilisan na papustuhan uh, na praktisa na. Pero sabi ko sa ibang member ng board sa ibang uh, kumbaga ano maagang dumating at uh, manalangin no kasi dapat ito yung bago nating iset na kultura hindi lang Wednesday no every Sunday morning kahit 5 minutes lang bawa 8:45 to 8:50 papanalangin specifically no hindi yung ganitong panalangin na general na maraming ano specific lang ang ipapanalangin service lang na wala walang darating na ganoon walang manggugulo na maayos ang worship maayos ang preaching ma-open yung heart ng tao, ma-born again, change of hearts, maba- mabago ang buhay, bumalik sa simbahan, walang mapood poison sa piging. Puro all about nangyayari. Pag nag walang masaktan. Alam mo yun, the entire day ng Sunday, kung ano yung nangyayari, yun lang pagpipray. Wala yung iba na pagpipray, may sakit ng ito, ganyan. Siguro, pagka special, ano, special na, na pagkakataon, pwede. Pero, Ang focus lang talaga ng prayer would be ano uh, would be what do you call this uh, would be service lang di ba so yeah totoo yun this is according to his will itong panalangin di ba kaya ahead of our time tayo mayroon tayong half million na uh, mobilization prayer project mula sa Church of the Nazarene and they are encouraging actually during Wednesday nagpe-pray kami mga senior pastors during umaga so uh, they are encouraging the churches no uh, to pray mag-set ng date at least once a month so eh tayo naman na kita naman ni ano ng ating uh, DS na talaga nagpe-pray tayo kasi may picture tayo may video tayo eh. hindi mo mapagkakaitson di ba hindi mo pagkakilala yun so may resibo ka kumbaga so yun, kumbaga uh, hindi na mahirap sumunod kasi ginagawa mo na parang ganun Okay, manalangin na tayo. Speaking of prayer, manalangin na tayo unless meron kayong gustong idagdag. So, welcome to Upper Zoom. Bakit Upper Zoom? Kasi naalala niyo sa Bible yung Upper Room. Kung saan sila nagmi-meet, yung mga Christians. No? Kasi sa Middle East, merong Upper Room na tinatawag. No? So, uh, doon sila nagmi-meet. Pagkatapos, uh, para rin hindi makita ng mga ibang, ano, ibang elemento na ayaw sa kanila. Uh, tayo naman, upper Zoom, kasi nasa Zoom tayo. Wala lang, pakulo lang natin yun. <laughs> Alright, manilangin tayo. Siyempre, ito pa rin yung pattern natin. Acts, ACTS, Adoration, Contrition, Thanksgiving, and lahat ng mga supplications natin. Kasunod na. 
All right. So magsisimula tayo sa general prayer. So uh, simulan ko ang panalangin bago ko ipasa kay Tita Fe. Hallelujah. Maraming salamat Panginoon. Salamat po. Salamat Lord. At uh, muli, eh, eto kami nakapanalangin sa inyo Panginoon. Salamat sa bago magbuka ang aming bibig ay alam nyo na ang aming mapanalangin at sinagot nyo na Panginoon according to your will Panginoon. Uh, dalangin namin Panginoon na uh, patuloy yung baguhin ang buhay namin, ang simbahan namin. Uh, marami pong tao na makakilala sa inyo, Panginoon. Pagpalain niyo, Panginoon, na lahat na nandito, na nanalangin sa inyo, o standing, kumbaga, standing, Panginoon, doon sa gap na kumbaga, para idugtong, Panginoon, na mga kaluluwa papunta sa inyo, Panginoon. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, na, na ikaw po ang tinataas namin, ikaw po ang ina-acknowledge sa amin sa buhay. We acknowledge that you are the King of Kings and Lord of Lords, Panginoon. Humingi kami ng kapatawaran, Panginoon, sa mga nasabi, na isip at uh, mga ginawa namin na hindi kaniya-anyaya sa, sa inyo pong uh, paningin, Panginoon. Dalangin namin na uh, kami po ipatawarin niyo, pagkalinisin niyo, Panginoon. At uh, kung sino man yung nakikinig at nanonood, uh, alam po namin na nanalangin din po sila na patawarin niyo po sila sa kanilang pagkakasala, Panginoon. Uh, dalangin namin, Panginoon, ang tauspusong pasasalamat sa lahat mga biyay na tanggap namin. Patuloy na tatanggap at matatanggap pa namin, Panginoon, bilang individual, pamilya at bilang simbahan, Panginoon. Nadalangin namin, Panginoon, ang mga sumusunod. Una-una yung uh, general prayer namin, Panginoon, na uh, pangunahan ni Tita Fe. Tita Fe? Uh, Nakamit po kay Tita. We continue to pray, dear God. We come before your throne of grace, your throne of mercy. We know, we are confident, dear Lord, that you will hear our prayers and accept them, Lord God, and meet every need in every way. We thank you for coming down to the level of every need uh, with our request tonight. Thank you, Lord God, that we can come to you at any time for anything, for there's nothing hard for you to do. Nothing is impossible with you. And you promise, dear Lord, that if we ask anything according to your will you will grant it O lord that your people may be blessed through mercy and the grace of our lord jesus christ we commit to you in behalf of china shanghai hong kong and taiwan lord you know the ins and the outs of god of this problem people are suffering from this crisis of covid But Lord God, everything is in your control. Lord God, and everything has its own timing. Lord, there's nothing impossible with you. We ask, oh God, that you will convict the people who have created this problem. May they commit their hearts to you, their lives to you. And may they know, dear God, that you are supreme that you are sovereign dear jesus and that anything that they do that is not according to your will O lord they will someday answer for it give the account for what they have done lord god in the name of jesus Come into their hearts, whoever they are in this country, countries, Lord. Um, convict them of anything, Lord, that is evil, wicked, against other people, against other nations. Take full control of this, Lord. Come down to this need. In the name of Jesus, we ask, Lord God. I declare that no weapon formed against the, your people. Mm shall prosper i plead the blood of jesus that you cover the righteous people those who are dedicated to you who live lives according to your perfect will cover them with the blood of jesus mm -hmm. speak to the hearts of everyone lord so that they will be conscious of the evil thoughts that they have The, the wickedness that is going on in this land, Lord, the originators of evil, deal with them, we pray, in the mighty name of Jesus. Grant peace between and among these places of God. Give peace, your peace, 
which you have granted, Lord God, to uh, your people. And you never change. You are the same yesterday and today and forever. Let your power work so that there will be peace between among these peoples in the name of Jesus Christ. God, I come against um, COVID and it's um, um, the source of it, the people involved in it. I come against it in the name of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. I cancel um, every plan of the wicked against mm -hmm. these people in the name of Jesus Christ by the blood of the Lamb of God. Mm -hmm. In the name of Jesus Christ, I come against you and I bind you COVID in the name of Jesus Christ mm -hmm. so that you stop taking lives from the people of God in the name of Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. in the name of Jesus by the blood of the Lamb, mm -hmm. the Holy Spirit of God, I come against you mm -hmm. and I command you to be gone mm -hmm. and to fall into the pits, the bottomless pit mm -hmm. from this time forward in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, and may the people of this land know that you are supreme, that you are sovereign, O oh God, that they have to submit to you Help them to give their hearts to you so that they will experience the love of God. And if they are filled with the love of God, they will have love for pe your people oh. in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I commit to you the election um, uh, next month, Lord, in the Philippines. Oh. We ask, dear Lord God, that it will be a peaceful election. That there will be no fights, uh -huh. no hatreds, yes. no wicked plans against one another as far as the candidates are concerned, Lord, and people supporting them. Uh -huh. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we claim a peaceful election in the Philippines in the next month, we pray. And we ask, O oh Lord, that you will give the people of the Philippines wisdom as to whom to vote for in the name of Jesus. May um, the love of the country and the prosperity of the country reign supreme in the hearts of your people throughout the land of the Philippines. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we claim godly people so that we will be guided the people will be guided according to the perfect will of god and thank you lord god for your blessing this election day in the philippines we pray we give up we 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 also raise or pray for ukraine and russia Mm -hmm. This war against each other in the name of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. As I said, dear Lord, no weapon formed against them, against the people of God shall prosper. In the name of Jesus Christ, I declare that God's power will be upon Russia, mm -hmm. convicting them of their wickedness, their plans against Ukraine. May the love of God control their thoughts, their hearts, their minds, so that they will learn to love the people of Ukraine. God, in the name of Jesus Christ, you said, whatever is bound on earth is bound in heaven, and whatever is loosed on earth is loosed in heaven. I bind the wickedness all forces of evil that come against Ukraine in the name of Jesus Christ. The evil plans of Ukraine, I bind it in the name of Jesus Christ. And you said, oh Lord, that everything that is loose on earth will be loosed in heaven. I therefore command wickedness all forces of evil, Satan and his hosts, to be loosed 
from their assignment against the people of Ukraine in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord God, touch the hearts of the people of Russia. Touch them with your love. Convict them of their sins. And may they reform and consider you, Lord, over them so that they can love the people of Ukraine and they will have victory over this war. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. And BA.2 Omicron, you are the name, but the name of Jesus Christ is above every name. COVID is suppressed. COVID is stopped. COVID is killed. COVID is gone. In the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Master. I declare, therefore, the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. All your people, O oh God, will live and not die. They will all be successful and will prosper because Jesus, you are King of kings and Lord of lords. Everything is in your command. Let this be according to the will of God. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, amen. Lord, we commit to you. Odette. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay. Go ahead, Brother Adrian. Thank you, Tita. Lord, thank you, Lord God, for uh, these people. Uh, Odette Perez, Ogi Perez, Alan Gabriel, Gab Reyes, Rian Rivera, Edward Salayal, uh, Hansa Salva Cruz, and Pastor Manny Salva Cruz, Sam Be Bezad Samadi, Mary Ann Ramos Samadi, Sara Samadi, Lord God. Lord, we just pray and declare uh, prosperity um, amongst these people, Lord God, that you will reach out to them, Lord God. Bless the work of their hands, Lord God. Um, may they be uh, continually um, searching you, Lord God, learning to know more about you, Lord God. May they stay humble, O Lord God. They may continue to uh, be Christ-like, O Lord God, and uh, get to know you more. And uh, may you uh, use them for your ministry, O Lord God, so more people will be saved and more people uh, could know about your word, O Lord God, and the good news, Lord God, of the gospel, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God, for their lives. Uh, may you continue to use them for your glory, Lord God. May they uh, be tes testimonies of your goodness, of your power, oh Lord God, of your uh, amazing love, Lord God. And we just uh, pray for them. Uh, may you bless them, Lord God. And uh, we just love you, Lord God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Yes, Heavenly Father, we praise you, we worship you. Itinataas po namin sa inyo ang Church of the Nazarene, uh, General Su Superintendent Duarte, Graves, Busik, Crocker, Jambo, Sandberg, District Office, Reverend Greg, Shea, Vanya, all seniors pastors and associates pastors, the board uh, Sister Gurley, Sister Fe, Sister Minda, Sister Pepot, Sister Rachel. Pastor Bong, the Phil Nas, Pastor Jeff, Pastor Norbert, Pastor Bong, Pastor mm -hmm. Ray, Pastor Rockled, yes, LA First English, Pastor Joshua, Pastor Dan, yes, Pastor Michael, Pastor Pedro, LA First Spanish, Pastor Wan, uh, Pastor Lina, LA First Praise South Korean, uh, Pastor Sung Dae Kim, and Pastor David Kim, LA First Arise, North Korean, Pastor John Wan Lee, MCB, um, Star Curtis, Nick Charles Maynor, and the Citizens of the World Charter Schools, Silver Lake, Pinoy Pastors and Churches, Covinas, New Hopeness, Faith, Hope, Love Assemblies, and iRadio. Uh, Father God, uh, pinagpipray po namin lahat ng mga pastors at lahat ng mga taong to na bigyan niyo ng wisdom and i-guide din po ninyo lahat ng mga pastors and reverence sa kanilang um, uh, pag, uh, sa pag-guide sa kanilang mga flock po 
and uh, marami pa pong masave na soul and uh, bigyan niyo sila ng provisions sa bawat congregation god na uh, makapag uh, plan sila ng mas magan mas mas maayos na congregation at uh, mas uh, mas maging maayos ang mga members din po at dumami rin pang members ng bawat congregation and of course lahat po ng family ng bawat pastor and board members and lahat ng mga uh, lahat ng mga nandito po sa listahan nito uh, good health po no covid mm. especially may lumalabas na bagong uh, virus na naman po protection po sa bawat family sa bawat isa po na uh, lahat po kami i-cover po ninyo ng inyong banal na dugo o oh, Jesus Christ and um and God uh, protection sa mga bata sa school na ilan niyo sila sa lahat ng mga uh, drugs and um Uh, yung mga hindi magandang gawain, God, and yung mga mas mga tao na gusto gumawa ng hindi maganda. And sa lahat ng mga teachers po, God, gabay, uh, gabay niyo rin po sila na safe din po sila parate at maturoan nila ng maayos lahat ng mga uh, estudyante na, na maging uh, magkaroon ng magandang buhay po, mm-hmm. magkaroon ng pangarap ang bawat isa. And God, uh, itong sa bawat churches din po, God, um, na lahat po is wala na pong maghihit na uh, na virus na na, na magkakasakit god and magkaroon ng pagkakaisa pagmamahalan and of course god uh, magkaroon ng peace in Jesus name we pray amen hallelujah lord god We praise you and we glorify your name, O Lord God. And O Lord God, that you are hearing our petitions, Lord God. We believe, Lord God, that whenever two or three are gathered in your name, O God, that you are there in the midst, O Lord God. So we present to you, Lord God, uh, tonight our sick uh, brothers and sisters who need your healing hands, O Lord God. Pray, O oh Lord God, for Giovanni, for his back pain, O oh Lord God, the uh, student, O oh Lord God, of Sister Mini, Panginoon. May you heal him, Panginoon, from his back pain, O oh God. We uh, we ask, O oh Lord God, that there will be no uh, fractures, O oh Lord God, in him, and that he will uh, completely recover from his pains, O oh Lord God. We also leave up to you, Lord God, Emmanuel Acevedo, was cyst on his lungs, O oh Lord God. <coughs> May you heal him, Lord, O oh Lord God, that and her, his biopsies, O oh Lord God, will co- turn out to be negative, O oh Lord God. Heal him, O oh Lord God, uh, that the doctors may find uh, solutions to ease up his, his pains, O oh Lord God. We also lift up to you, Miguel Noel, O oh Lord God, for his brain surgery, O oh God. Uh, we don't know, O oh Lord God, if that brain surgery has already been uh, conducted, O oh Lord God, but we pray, O oh Lord God, that whenever, O oh Lord God, he is now, <clears throat> in the, whether he is recovering, O oh Lord God, that you give him complete healing, O oh Lord God, for his brain, O oh Lord God. Let the all the wounds be healed in Jesus' name and And let all the and the pains, O oh Lord God, be completely gone for him, O oh Lord God. We also pray for Patrick Noel, O oh Lord God, that he will be able to walk, O oh God. Make him <clears throat> make him strong, make his legs be strong, O oh Lord God, that he will be completely go to normal again and be able to walk. You know that nothing is impossible to you, O oh Lord God. You are able to heal the man who was not able to walk for all his life. So, Lord God, we 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 are thankful, O oh Lord God, that you can still have the miracles, O oh Lord, that you were able to do in the past, O oh Lord God, because you are a God who is the same yesterday, today, and forever, O oh Lord God. We also pray for Miss, Mrs. Leonila Samson, O oh God, that you uh, heal her of her dementia, O oh God. Let her memories be functional again, O oh Lord God, that you will remember 
especially, O oh Lord God, that uh, Sister LB will be going home, O oh Lord God. To her, O oh Lord God, may they have a, a happy reunion, O oh Lord God. May she remember her, O oh Lord God, and all her children, O oh Lord God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus, for uh, <clears throat> getting back to his memories, O oh Lord God. We also pray for Mrs. Krieger for uh, that she may <clears throat> recover from her swallowing problem and also her her weight, O oh Lord God, may she uh, be able to regain her uh, appetite, O oh Lord God, and may she able to control her water level also, O oh Lord God, and, and his lungs, O oh Lord God, and may she be able, O oh Lord God, to recover from her loneliness and her maybe depression, O oh Lord God. Thank you, Lord God. Be with her always. Make her happy, O oh Lord God. We also pray, O oh Lord God, for Sally Isma, for her osteoarthritis and vertigo, O oh God. May you heal her, heal her completely, O oh Lord God, from these sicknesses, O oh Lord God. And we also pray for Diana Santiago for her Parkinson's disease, O oh God. Thank you, Lord God, that you are our healing God, that you can, you are able, O oh Lord God, you are our great healer that you will heal Miss Diana, O oh God, of the Parkinson's disease, O oh Lord God. And we also pray, O oh Lord God, for Sister Fe Dumok, O oh Lord God, for, the, for, for her left eye surgery on May 13, O oh Lord God. May you uh, keep her strong, O oh Lord God, for the surgery. May you give wisdom to the doctor, O oh God, and may she be able to recover Swiftly, O oh Lord God, from that surgery, O oh Lord God. Lord, give her uh, all the things that she needed, O oh Lord God, physically, emotionally, and spiritually, O oh Lord God, to be able to go through that surgery. Thank you, God. We also pray for the foot of uh, Steve, uh, Tep Tep, O oh Lord God. May you continue to heal her, heal him, O oh Lord God. He's still having pains, O oh Lord. Lord, you are, uh, you know this uh, boy, O oh Lord God, that uh, he is, uh, although, although he is not hearing well, O oh Lord God, and you cannot talk, O oh Lord God, but his heart is with you, O oh Lord God. He likes to serve you, O oh Lord God. So we, we pray, O oh Lord God, for the complete healing of his foot, O oh Lord God. We also pray for Pastor Bert. Uh, we continue to pray for his veins, O oh Lord God, that you continually uh, heal him, O oh Lord God. Thank you, Father, for his ministry, O oh God. Uh, may you guide them, O oh Lord, protect them in the Philippines now, O oh Lord God, together with Sister LB, O oh Lord God. And we, I also pray, O oh God, for my sister, Tess O oh Lord God, for her continuous the dialysis, O oh Lord God. May you continue to give her strength, O oh Lord God. May you heal her of her vertigo, O oh Lord God. Thank you, Lord, for giving her strength, O oh Lord God, and the financial support, O oh Lord God. Thank you, Jesus, for all this healing. I know that you will, uh, you are hearing us, O oh Lord God, for all our supplications, O oh Lord God. We ask you this in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord for continuous uh, your continuous uh, healing for for all these people who we are praying for. Oh Lord, thank you, Lord, for being with us. Thank you, Lord, for your healing power upon us. Oh Lord, mm -hmm. I lift up to you, Lord. Alet Castro from the rest from the chemo, Mr. Edge Rochelle lung cancer stage four, and Janet breast cancer. Lord, I pray, Oh Lord, that. At this very moment, you are touching the bodies of these people, O oh Lord. Mm -hmm. You are healing them, O oh Lord, and your healing power, your healing hands will be upon them. We pray, O oh Lord, uh, we are confident that your healing will be with them, O oh Lord. Huwag di po silang hayaan na ma-depress, nararamdaman po nila tulad po ng ginawa niyo sa akin. You gave us me your healing power, so so to them, I pray, O Lord, na ibibigay niyo rin po yung ibinigay niyo sa amin. 
Marami pong salamat and we claim, O Lord, your healing upon their bodies, O Lord, from their head to their foot, O Lord, right now we claim healing upon them. Mm -hmm. And cover them with your most precious blood and they may they be able to, to accept whatever uh, situation uh, they are in right now and claim your healing power upon their bodies. Thank you, Lord. I also pray for protection and provision for the pregnancy of Christina, Joanne, and Darren. Lord, I lift up to you these three mothers, O oh Lord, as they are going, uh, as they are uh, uh, on their pregnancy, O oh Lord. I pray, Lord, na matayan niyo po ang kanilang, ang kanilang kalusugan, ang kanilang pangangatawan. I pray for the for the ob who are taking care of them, O oh Lord, that they, they will be able to give them the good nutrients that they need, and especially for the babies. And I pray also for this obese gynies, O oh Lord, na ibigay sa kanila, Lord, ang tamang check-up, ang tamang pag-aalaga sa kanila while nagbubuntis po sila, Lord. And I also pray, Lord, na pag-oras sa ng kanila panganganak, Lord, ay... Uh, Mm -hmm. Ilalabas nila ang mga bata ng normal, mm -hmm. in good condition, mm -hmm. walang anumang depression, Lord. Mm -hmm. I also pray for the, for the, mm -hmm. ito, yung nag-aalaga sa mga babies, oh Lord, na mm -hmm. ibigay din po sa kanila ang tamang nutrients at vitamins at tamang mga, tamang mga, uh, I don't know, Pagkaalaga sa kanila, Lord, yung kanilang mga vaccination ibibigay po sa kanila, Lord, ng tama para lumaki po ang mga sanggol na ito na maayos, malusog. At tinataas din po namin ang mga batang ipapanganak nila na makakilala rin po sa inyo, mag-dedicate po sa inyo. Naniniwala po kami, Lord, na ang mga nanay na ito ipalalakihin ang mga batang ito ng naaayon sa inyong kagustuhan at ipakikilala po kayo sa kanila, O Lord. Marami po salamat sa pag-iingat nyo sa mga mothers na ito at kayo mm -hmm. sa mga doktors na nag-aalaga sa kanila, sa kanilang mga ob sa kanilang mga pediatrician. I also live up to you, Lord. Comfort for the Inigo, Giwa, and Muñoz family, Lord. Mahirap po, Lord, ang mawala ng loved ones at naniniwala kami na kayo po ang gumagabay sa kanila, kayo po ang nagbibigay ng comfort sa kanila, kayo po, Lord, ang mag-sustain ng kanilang Uh, mga nararamdaman, O Lord, naniniwala po kami, Lord, na in your time, O Lord, healing will be upon them, O Lord, at uh, patatanggap po nila yung na ang loved ones nila ay kasama nyo na po, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for all the answers to this prayer request. We lift them all up to you, Lord, and we claim answered prayers, O Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Sister Mini. It's your time. <laughs> Lord, uh, we thank you, Lord God, for uh, for uh, the trip, Lord God, that you have given, Lord God, to Brother Aldrin, Lord, I pray that you would keep him safe, Lord, as he go back to the Philippines. I pray that it would be full, Lord God, and he will be a blessing, Lord God, to the people there. Let your protection be upon him, Lord God, keep him safe. Uh, we pray, Lord God, for the safety and security in the Wiley and Courtyard, Lord. We pray, O oh God, that your protection would be upon, Lord God, that place. Uh, we rebuke, Lord God, all the spirits, Lord God, is not uh, roaming around, Lord God, in that area. It is not according to your will, Lord God. We, we cast it away, Lord God, in the name of Jesus. And we pray, Lord God, for the spirit, Lord God, of of uh, wellness, Lord God, and security, Lord God, in that place, Lord. Father, we pray for Mar Marco Castilla, Lord God, for his depression and protection and blessings for his four children, Lord God. I pray, oh God, that you would uh, uh, heal him, Lord God, from, from this depression, Lord God. I pray that you would, uh, he would look, look up his eyes unto you, Lord God. And trust in your unfailing love, Lord God. I pray for Jarell and his wife, Jan's family, for the approval of their papers, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for your will, Lord God, for families to be reunited, Lord God. Uh, will happen, Lord God. I know that you have a purpose in the life of Jarell and his wife and Jan's family, Lord God. 
Thank you, Lord God, for blessing them. I pray for a quick processing of their papers, Lord God, in Jesus' name. And we pray, Lord God, for the child custody of Shane. I pray, oh God, that uh, you will grant favor, Lord God, to the person, Lord God, who's deserving, Lord God. And I pray, oh God, that uh, your protection will be upon the child, Lord. I pray in Jesus' name. Father, I pray for Rachel. I pray that she will pass, Lord God, and flex exam. I pray that you would provide her all of the information that she needed for the test. I pray, oh God, for a calm mind, Lord God, when she's taking the test. And I pray that you would help her recall, Lord God, the things that she needs to answer for the test, Lord. In Jesus' name. Lord, you pray for Raimundo Anastasia, Madrid, and Jaya for a new home. Lord, you are the one who's going to bless, Lord God, each and every one of uh, this uh, people, Lord God, who are uh, who was, who's um, doing your will in, Lord God, in their lives. I pray for your provision. I pray that you would give them wisdom, Lord God, where to get this money to, Lord God. Provide them with uh, all the blessings, Lord God, that they can have, Lord God, for them to increase their uh, capacity, Lord God, to earn money, Lord. Lord, I pray for blessing upon their lives, Lord God, in Jesus' name. I pray for Pagios, Lord. I pray for Sister LB and Pastor Bert and her family. I pray, oh God, that thank you for they have been a blessing in their in our lives, Lord God, in the lives of the the people in the church. I pray that you would keep them safe wherever they go. I pray that you would give them favor for everything that they're gonna do. Your protection will be upon them, Lord God. And I pray, oh God, that um, whatever transaction that they're going to do, Lord God, I pray that you would help it, Lord God, to mapabilis um, on so that they would have more time, Lord God, to spend with their family and loved ones, Lord God. Make this visit, Lord God, very fruitful and a blessing, Lord God, for the people around them, Lord. I pray for James, safety in the Philippines, and their wedding celebration. We consecrate our lives, their lives to you, Lord God, James and his wife. I pray, oh God, that they would truly really commit their lives, Lord God, to you. And when they come back here in U.S., Lord God, I, I pray that they would commit, Lord God, to L.A. Fillness, Lord. I pray for Sister Faith, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for her life, for she has been a blessing, Lord God, to us and to the people around her, Lord. May you continue, Lord God, to... To speak to her, Lord God, to open her ears so that she will hear from you, Lord God. Only the truth, Lord God, is coming from you. I pray for all the plans of the enemy, Lord God, na, na mawala panginoon. And I pray, oh God, as she submits herself to you, Lord God, Lord, the devil will flee away from her, Lord. And I pray, oh God, for prosperity in her life. I pray for... Uh, job in the future, Lord God, and her uh, future partner, Lord God, for her, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Pray for grace. I pray for a special favor from God. Um, and we pray for wedge, Lord God, to continue to give her wisdom, Lord God, as she takes, Lord God, the exam, Lord. And I, I pray that you would continue, Lord God, to speak to her heart too, Lord. To commit her life, Lord God, to you. And also, Lord God, for her to come back, Lord God, and visit the church, Lord God. Whatever church there is, Lord God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Lord, we are lifting up to you. Mga connecting events namin, Panginoon, kung saan, Panginoon, magkagamit namin for evangelism and discipleship kung ito, ito, uh, ito po ay according sa will niyo, Panginoon. Base po, Panginoon, sa Great Commission, Panginoon. Uh, dalangin namin, Panginoon, na mga pupunta dito ay makakilala sa inyo, magstay sa simbahan, lumago, at uh, maging kagamit-gamit din ang buhay nila para po sa kalwalhatian niya, Panginoon. Dalangin namin ang celebration ng Mother's Day na ma ma maging uh, special na araw to para sa aming mga ina, ma-honor namin sila Mabigyan namin sila na masarap na pakiramdam na sila po ay minamahal. At uh, uh, mabigyan namin ng gifts and everything, Panginoon, na 
members o hindi, Panginoon, na lahat ng pupuntang ina doon ay inyo pong pagpapalain, Panginoon. Maraming salamat, Panginoon, sa Youth Overnight. Dalangin namin ang safety and security ng mga bata. Dalangin namin walang masasaktan. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, na matututo sila sa gabi na yun at mag enjoy Panginoon. Na ma-maximize nila ang kanilang youth, Panginoon, na pwede pong mag-enjoy na hindi lang gumimik sa bar o ano pa man sa pumunta, kundi pwede mag-enjoy, Panginoon, na gumimik kasama kayo at uh, maging masaya ang buhay nila bilang kabataan, Panginoon, na nakakilala sa inyo. Dalangin namin yung plano namin na mamigay ng sanitizer, Panginoon, maging evangelism program to Panginoon, makakilala, mag- makapagbigay kami ng mga materyales sa mga kapagturo, Panginoon, na may simbahan kami at pumunta po sila, Panginoon. Dalangin namin ang mga darating na kaluluwa na pagpalain nyo at kayo po ang magdala, Panginoon. Dalangin namin ang Father's Day. Kayo po ang um, gumawa ng programa para sa mga ama, Panginoon, na sa tulong ng, uh, ng mga women at saka ng youth, Panginoon. Dalangin na, namin na uh, ang mga darating na ama, lalo na yung mga mga hindi pa nakapunta sa simbahan namin, Panginoon, ay pagpalain niyo ang puso, Panginoon. At uh, sila po ay maging dahilan to, Panginoon, para po sila ay uh, makakilala sa inyo at mag-stay sa simbahan, Panginoon. Dalangin namin ng family camp, ganun din ang COVID-19, Panginoon. Uh, lahat ng preparation, pangangailangan, uh, provisions para sa mga sasali at sasama, Panginoon, yung pera. Uh, kayo po ang mag-provide, Panginoon, at safety and security sa lugar, Panginoon. We pray, Panginoon, sa Volleyball Part 3 na kung saan, Panginoon, ay uh, nakaka, nakakakuha kami, Panginoon, ng mga bagong kaluluwa. Nalangin namin na patuloy yung gamitin ng proyekto na to, ang connecting event na to, ang evangelistic uh, 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 sports na to, Panginoon, para po patuloy na uh, madami makilala ang kabataan, Panginoon, sa, sa inyo, Panginoon. Tinataas sa amin sa inyo, Panginoon, for protection, blessings, and provisions ang mga negosyo, Panginoon, ng LNG Nursing Group, Aerotechnic, at ang uh, Retailo, Panginoon. Dalangin namin na pagpalaan niyo po ang kanilang mga negosyo. Maging uh, glory, glory, Panginoon, sa pangalan mo yung uh, mga ginagawa nila at uh, may dedicate nila negosyo nila para sa iyo, Panginoon. Panginoon, uh, ito po ang mga marami naming dalangin. Uh, nagmumula sa aming puso, Panginoon, alam namin na sinagot niya na, Panginoon. Sa akin pinito, hayaan niyo pang pagpalain ko po ang mga inyo pong mga anak. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn His face toward you and give you peace. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Ayan. Picture ta- Ayan na si Aye. Picture taking na eh. Hi, Aye. Amen. 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 <laughs> I see you, Aye. I see you. I see you, huh? I see you. Hello. I see you. Why? I see you, Okay, picture tayo. Alright. Okay, Amy, magbukas mo pa ba yung ano mo? Bintana. Ay. <laughs> Ay, mo pa. Okay. One, two, three. Smile, Aye. There you go. All right. God bless you guys. Salamat sa panalangin. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Aya. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.